Yes, prioritize the leather over the food. Let's go. I can't wait to when I leave this world. It's the, like the world size is just going to be like at least over 100 megs. Because right now it hasn't hit 100 yet. So now imagine if like looting the village actually like made them aggressive, the uh, Iron Golem. Once we make it back, guys, that's when we'll actually finally be able to start uh, our journey to kill the Wither. Or not, it's not really even going to be a journey. I'm just going to set up like a thing underground or even in the nether be like, boom, there we go. Oh, it's glow squids. Screw you for being born. Look, I'll be honest. I wanted ice illagers because I wanted a challenge, man. It'd be so funny. Just like an actual hostile mob that you can fight during the day. Like. Just like the other illagers. Like. Wow. I did that mistake last time when I died. Why did I do it again? Again, I love how just calming it is to just glide through the air. Wait, I've been here. Yeah, wait, there's gold nuggets here. You don't just find gold nuggets randomly in a chest. I swear if I fly over this ocean and I notice, like, the Elder Guardian's thing, I actually would legit, like, make a temporary base here just to be able to access it. Oh, wait! Oh! Axolotl! Ah, look at him! What are you doing out here, buddy? Oh, my God. Nah, I don't even think my cooked fish will do, will it? It wants raw fish, doesn't it? Hold on. I will get you your raw fish. I will literally... Do what is necessary to get... Oh, he's disappeared. Wait, do you know? Oh, it's tropical fish. Oh, my God. Why do you guys have to be so awkward? Gotta get up to the surface before I get sexually harassed by the dolphins. Oh, wait. Yo, wait, no way. I swear I saw, like, the top of the temple. Just right in my crosshair now. I think that is it. Oh, my God, it is. Isn't it? Okay, we'll know when the Elder Guardian thing appears on screen. <gasps> Oh my god, okay, never mind. I can see it well and clear. That is the Elder Guardian's temple. Yep. Um, yeah, guys, um, <laughs> that, that is what it is. That's the Elder Guardian's temple. I'm gonna be real with you. Why do I have to end up in, like, the worst areas, man? Why do I put myself in the worst areas, actually? This is probably the question I should be asking. Okay, I know this seems like a bad idea. Oh, it, it is, Joe, because now you can't pick that up. He's, oh my god. Oh, I don't even... Okay, I have a flint of steel. You know what? This is a bad idea, Joe. Don't do it. <laughs> just, 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 just don't do it, Joe. Please. That ran out so fast. Efficiency and gold don't go together too well. If you have a trident, come near me. If you don't, then go away. That's where my Minecraft journey started. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that in a video, but, like, I actually started playing Minecraft because of an Xbox 360 demo from, like, the official Xbox magazine back in the day. When they actually used to do demos and stuff. Uh, yeah, let's get the unbreaking instead. Because the unbreaking gold stuff is actually cracked. And you can't argue with me against that. Like, it just is. Glow squid. Hey, give me my boat back. Sorry if the commentary is not really riveting. I know I've been saying, oh, this is cool, this is cool. But, like, there's not much to comment about when you're basically just farming at this point. You have literally a nanosecond to tell me where the sheep are. But, yeah. The Nihondes fish. Isn't this base beautiful, guys? Look at it. So nice. There we go. Look how beautiful that is. Like, if I could kill this boss now, go home and kill the Wither after that. Like, I've literally done what this series has set out, you know? And I can finally move on to doing a hardcore series. God, this house is beautiful. Look at, like, I'm looking down on it. You can see how beautiful it is. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hey guys, the Knife Flyer here. Welcome back to the Minecraft series once again. So when the last recording ended, I literally am, uh, well, continuing from there. Yep, that's it. So obviously, as you already will probably know, that is our target. And I thought about it whilst having dinner. I could literally just use these, like, uh, doors. First, we'll make a sword. Boom. Done. Okay, honestly, I didn't think we were going to get that that fast. <laughs> I was actually expecting to mine down in the ground for a bit. Hey, chicken. And done. And done. There you go. Oh, is that deep slate? Oh, yo, we f I found deep slate. Then we can produce a ridiculous amount of doors. Now, the question is, how many doors? Honestly, 33 seems like a good amount. Dip in the water. Oh, oh is that... Oh, that's a guy with a trident as well. Hold on. Wait, that's got me curious now. Yeah, come up here, big boy. Hold on. Let me let, let me just put this away. Uh, I need to kill him. Ah, I don't think he dropped it. Oh, yeah, wait. Do doors actually still work? Did I just make 32 doors for no reason? Oh, no. I am not very smart. Well, um, hmm. How else do you do it, then? How? Wait. Because, like, I was so used to things. I'm still making the buckets, alright? I'm still making them. It's just... 
how does Ting work? Right, new plan. We're gonna find magma blocks somehow, magically. Jerry Jays, Joe, have a good swim there in the water now. Right, what is that? Oh, that's another one. Oh, wait, I can get in this one. <gasps> oh, that's so cool. Can I pick it up? Oh, that's so cool. That's so cool. These are new blocks as well. Calcite and smooth basalt. Okay, I guess I'll leave these alone. I won't take too much out of them. Yeah, that. Oh, that's another pole. So there's definitely a magma block here. Yeah, I could see it now around me. How is that allowed? Just make sure to not like drown. When you drown in the deep and your brain goes Yeah, yeah. Yeah, see, I knew it would work. That's how smart I am. Like, I'm ridiculously. Oh, I thought the block disappeared. <laughs> After calling myself ridiculously smart as it, like on purpose, you know, just to nudge the series into pushing something bad onto me. Now that we know this works, it is time to acquire what we want. There you go. See? Taking a look at enemy base. Seems very empty, actually, if I'm being honest. Remember, Joe, build your base on the very top there. I'm not going to drink unless I need it. Okay. Build it out a bit. I didn't mean to use this much wood, but it just kind of happened. Right, we have a place that we can retreat to. Now it's just setting up checkpoints. Oh, he's right in here. Fella, this is going to be really underwhelming. Okay, hold on, wait. Give me a second. This fella is literally right below me. Um, what do I need? I can't remember. Oh, yeah, I need to drink the milk. Okay, let me up, let me up, let me up. Ah! Ooh, okay, that was uh, tough, to say the least. Okay, okay, good to go back in. Bro, we did it! <laughs> it's just like, that's it, let's go. Nah, no, I'm gonna, I have to explore more now. That <laughs> that felt like so underwhelming. I think it's good, obviously because I faced the Ender Dragon first, but it's mainly because I over-prepared for this as well. <laughs> Yeah, see, there's multiple of them here, so, like, we might as well keep going whilst we're here. Uh, sponge. Trust, th this this thing is going to be so handy to use to get through. Basically, every charcoal is the amount I can dry out the sponge. And if I find more sponges, ooh, God help the rest of the Elder Guardians down there. Oh my God, I should have just kept mining. Okay, I might need... <laughs> okay. Mm. No, no, I want this. Trust. Oh my god, I, I, I'm so slow. There we go, got it, okay. Now we can head in. 